We've been nervously, nervously awaiting the call. Oh, good. Oh, yay. Okay. Just to let you know, overall, we were able to free the way. Oh my gosh, yay. Oh my god. What? I haven't sat down to talk to you in so long. So long. Because oh I gosh. felt like I was dying. Yeah, you were very sick. So where do we start from? Maybe the retrieval, I guess. The retrieval was on Friday. What was the date? Yep. Uh, I'll write it I here. Think the 19th. 19th maybe? Yeah. So after the egg retrieval, I called Allie to tell her how many eggs we had and drum roll, how many eggs were there? 27. 27 eggs. 27 eggs. She got very sick. So, so yeah, you went to bed. I woke you up so you could get Tylenol because you had a lot of pain. And that was the worst thing. And then she was like, the nausea, I'm gonna throw up. And you were like, like shaking like this, like just shaking. And I clammy, but I felt cold. hot. Felt like I had a fever, but you said I didn't. You were freezing, like ice cold. And I was like convulsing. I was yeah, so- Yeah, it was very strange. I and was like, oh no. <laughs> Allie for so long just sat and held my hand. I think you were scared I was gonna die. Well, I was like, should I take this? you to the hospital. She literally just <laughs> sat on the bed and held my hands and stared at me for like- I was waiting for you to sleep because I gave you lots of medicine and- But it didn't put me to sleep. You had a long night and then a long day and then a long night and then a long day and then a long night. And I've been and sick ever day. since. So I developed OHSS. I'm still sick. So OHSS, what happens is because of the IVF drugs, my ovaries were overstimulated. So they started leaking fluid into my ab abdomen. I was gonna say abdominal cavity. Yeah, it was yeah. not pretty. So the first sign I think was the nausea and then the diarrhea. Yeah. And then I was, I was this close to vomiting and I have a, f a horrible fear of throwing up. I've been fighting it for the last week trying not to throw up. I didn't. You didn't. And I good. logically know that like you feel better if you throw up typically, but no, it's not happening. Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Oh, Today's yeah. Thursday. Finally. I'm finally feeling better. <laughs> I'm still very bloated. Do you want to see my stomach? I look like I'm pregnant. Yeah. It's I'm a, not. It's a big belly. And then while that was all happening, we were getting calls from the clinic with embryo updates. Yeah, so they call on day one, which is the day after. It starts like day one is the next day of yes. after retrieval. So they called on day one. And? And they said 22 were mature. 22. So of the 27, 22 were mature and 17 fertilized, which mm -hmm. was really good. We were really happy with that. And then they called us again on day two to tell us how they were growing and what they were all looking like. And what did they say? Yeah, so on day two, all 17 that were fertilized were growing. 14 had four cells, two had two cells, and one had six cells. Yes. So that was good. She said they were exceptional. Yeah. So we had a we good feeling going into that. And then they don't call you till day six if you're doing a freeze all, which we were doing. So then we had to wait, which I didn't really think about it until then. Yesterday we were like, oh, it's too long. So yeah, they then we were in the waiting times. Then didn't really think about it because I was so sick. Yeah, it was. It really like made us not think about it at all. So People sick. say it's worse than the two week wait, but for us, ooh, not at all even comparable. Not at all to the two week wait. So that was good. Like it, we didn't think about it all week. Yeah. And then yesterday we started to think about it and we're like, oh my gosh. What today. if none of them make it? Yeah. That was a scary thought. Cause it can happen for it sure. Happen. Nothing is guaranteed at all. Maybe like we get four embryos or I, I was really hoping for six embryos. Six was your number. Like it just felt like that would give us some chances, yeah. you know? And then they called. And they did call, like 11 or something. Yeah. And we said, hello. I'll insert the footage. Here you go. <laughs> hello. <laughs> Long time no see. So today is the day we find out about our embryos. We're waiting for them to call. Oh my God. Here, 
Yeah, he, are you, Lolly? I'm good. Sam's here too now. Hi. We've been nervously, nervously awaiting the call. Well, I think I have good news for you. Oh, good. Oh, yay. Okay, with Tomo, just to let you know, overall, we were able to freeze away nine <gasps> embryos at the blast of the stage. Oh, oh my <laughs> gosh, yay. Oh, my God. What? Oh, yay. <laughs> That's so good. Yeah. Whoa. That's so good. Oh, my gosh. It's wonderful news. Wonderful news. Oh, That's yay. wild. We have nine frozen embryos. Nine babies. Oh my gosh. It's so nine many. It's babies. so many more than I thought Ooh. we'd ever get. I know. I really didn't think we'd get nine. I was very shocked. We're really happy with nine. It's it's crazy yeah. that they're existing. What's next? So now we have to wait again. One to two weeks, she'll get your, you'll get a period. Yeah. Well, no, it should be about a or week. Or maybe now. soon. Now. now to a week. Yeah. And then the next period, so another one. And then we call. Then on day 21, you can start a medication. Then the next month, you start another medication. So it's quite a process for a frozen, frozen transfer where we are anyways. It's about a month and a half. So that's the next step. We have quite the process ahead of us until we can transfer one of them in. But I'll be thinking of them every day. I know, you're so I excited. I want to see them. <laughs> I just want to see what they look like. But they're waiting for us, which is very nice. At least they're there. Yeah. And they're ready. No, we aren't having nine babies. <laughs> well, technically they could all become They babies. could all take, but I think it's 50 to 60% chance of each one sticking. So like we could not get pregnant the first time. It might take two or potentially three yeah. transfers. So it doesn't mean we're going to have nine babies <laughs> one year later. And it's still going. <laughs> it's is it ever it's gonna still going, but at least we have them. Yes. One of those here. at least will be our baby. Of yeah. nine, one will work. One is waiting for us. Yeah. There we go. That's your update. So everything's good. Now we can get back to our regular scheduled vlogging. Yes. What should, what should we? Okay, I want to name all nine embryos by their grades. So they gave us the grading of each embryo, so like, I can distinguish them. <laughs> I want to name them all. Some of them are the same. Not like their real name, what they would be, but like nicknames, so that when they come to be transferred, I can give them a nickname. Why don't you give them a nickname when they're transferred? No, I like to talk. Jeez. I want to talk about them now. What I if know. I want to talk to them? I can't. <laughs> I know. But I can talk to them. Like, we can talk about them. <laughs> Allie is very excited. Let me so am I. So leave your funny name, or like, recommendations below. Yes. Nine of them, please. Yes. Okay. Sure. And we will see you soon for another <laughs> see video. You soon. Okay. Bye. 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 Bye.